Um, what effect can drugs have on the body at like a high school age? Well, I mean, that's a, there's a lot, obviously. Um, you know, in terms of memory, you mm -hmm. know, the hippocampus, uh, you know, the brains of teenagers are still developing. The mm -hmm. hippocampus um, is responsible for learning and memory. Yeah. They get into alcohol and drugs, you know, uh, especially to any extent, mm -hmm. may harm the hippocampus yeah. and their ability you know, to learn and, and mm -hmm. uh, remember, okay? And that's obviously bad for a teenager in terms yeah. of academics. You know, athletics it can do a number of different things from slow the reaction time to mm -hmm. um, make them too jittery, mm -hmm. uh, depending on the drug they're taking. Um, it's illegal, number one, you get suspended. Mm -hmm. You can get uh, suspended for part or all of your season. Um, there's just a lot of things that it, it's going to interfere with memory, memory, learning, you know, your academics, athletic yeah. progress, and so on. Mm -hmm. So I'm here with P.J. Attard, a junior here at Gross Point South, and I'm asking him about his experiences in high school with drugs and alcohol. So, P.J., have you ever witnessed someone do drugs or drink? Uh, yes, I have witnessed uh, at my time going to Gross Point South. Students and friends of mine who have uh, done drugs and have been uh, consuming alcohol. Okay. So, P.J., what happened to your friends or acquaintances when they tried these drugs or drink alcohol? Um, normally what would happen is that their speech pattern would slur, they would sometimes have trouble talking, they might ramble on. Um, it seemed like they didn't have great control of their bodies. It really did feel like they were completely other people once they had consumed the alcohol. Yeah, it's very unsafe. Mm -hmm, yes. How good do you feel that you've never done drugs or alcohol? You no, know, it makes me feel good about myself that I've never done anything like that, anything bad. You know, how much I respect the law and how I have values and my parents respect me more because I don't do it like all the other kids that do it and that they talk to parents, their friends, and all their children are doing it and getting caught. And, you know, how sad and mad they are at them, but how my parents respect me for yeah. not doing those drugs. That's great, Connor.